We see birds during the day foraging, flying, and hear them vocalizing. But when the sun goes down, everything gets quiet. Where did they go? How do that many birds suddenly disappear? Are they sleeping? And if so, where and how do they sleep? So, where do they sleep? Songbirds will seek shelter in dense foliage or on branches high up in a tree. They choose branches that are close to the trunk and on the side that's most protected from the elements. They may also use windowsills underneath the eave of a house, tree cavities, or nest boxes. Wild turkeys sleep in trees to avoid ground predators, and ducks usually sleep floating on the water. Hawks sleep high up in trees, usually close to the trunk. There's a common misconception that birds sleep in nests. This is only the case during the breeding season, if it has eggs or young. Okay, but why don't we see them? Quite simply, because it's dark and they are well hidden from view. They may also be alone or with one other bird, which will be much harder to spot than if it was a large flock. Also, some trees like evergreens have densely packed branches and it's hard to see into the tree during the day, let alone at night. The next question is, how do they sleep? Some birds fluff themselves up, tuck their beak into their back feathers, and pull one foot up. The muscles in their legs force the tendons in their feet to tighten around the perch, making falling extremely unlikely. Instead of getting all their sleep in one go, like most humans, most birds are polyphasic sleepers, taking hundreds of short naps every day. They have very short REM cycles of about nine seconds and non-REM cycles of about two and a half minutes. The exception to this are birds that go into torpor, such as some hummingbirds and poor wills. Birds have the ability to sleep with one eye open in what's called unihemispheric slow wave sleep. In this state, one half of their brain is asleep while the other half is alert and ready to spring into action if needed. One such bird to use this ability is the frigate bird. They can simultaneously navigate and catch a few seconds of sleep. It's not hard to find a sleeping bird during the day, but have you ever seen one at night? If you have, I'd love to hear about it. Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching. That's all for this time. I'll see you again soon.